Try to sell beats online. Yo, what's up? This is Al from RealBeatSales.com, the number one marketing resource for music producers like yourself. If you need help marketing your beats, come over to uh, RealBeatSales.com. Click home uh, on the front page. Put your name and your email in, and I'm going to send you some nice information, keep you up to date on all the marketing, internet marketing things going on. Uh, so you could be afloat, know what's going on and out here on, on this internet. And if that's not enough, I uh, got free videos on the homepage, over 111 videos. And I have the course that you could become a member of Real Beat Sales University, over 52 videos that'll help you with marketing your business the right way. Way so you can win, and if that's not enough, I got even more stuff for you. EliteMusicProducers.com. Go over there, check it out. Click shop. I even have free, no free beats shirts. No free beat shirts. Go over there, get your shirt. Let people know you ain't giving out no free beats, man. Um, all right. Now in today's video, I want to talk about something, man. I know we talk a lot about being online, right? And I told y'all before, somebody had asked me this question. I said, yeah, you can be online, but you got to have balance. Got to play both worlds. Um, If you want to get into this whole uh, placement and you really want to be that super producer that you see on TV, where they everywhere, they faces everywhere, you have to do that. You have to be everywhere. You have to pound the pavement and work offline. Right, I'm telling you how this works. When you work offline, right, and, I, and you can set it up beautifully to work offline. You hitting up uh, talent shows. You know what I'm saying? You going to the club. You talking to people, handing out flyers, doing you know stuff like that. You can even build an email list while you out, man. Get your little app with that Aweber app. Put it on your phone, right, and let people know, yo, this is what I do, man. Let me get your email and your name. I'm gonna send you something. You go get on my list. Yada 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 Things like that And this is what you build it with uh, Artists at showcases And things of that nature Right Cause you go with a fish off It's not hard um, And then you have your cards Your business cards You know your flyers Like I said With your email address And your website on it When people get stuff like that And they constantly see you In the streets They go to find you online Right that's how you build that following. And then the people on the streets go online and then they say, yo, I was in a club with uh, whatever, foul ad the other night. And um, we was chilling. They taking pictures, you know, showing us Instagram, this, that, and the third. And people are like, oh, okay, yo, this guy cool. Then the next person followed. Then the next person. And then, and then it's a constant thing where people are constantly seeing you out and about. And they know, yo, this dude is real. All right, all right, and then I'm telling you, they your Twitter start popping all of a sudden, your Instagram start getting more likes, right? Because you don't interact with these people in, in real life, um, and you basically create your own little world, your own little universe, right? So work both. Um, you can't just sit in the basement all day; it's not gonna work. Like you could build a following online, but after a while, you gonna have to come outside, man. You have to. You, it, it just It's people you need to meet In person Right Cause there's people in person That's not on the internet But have power on the internet Like some of these bloggers You never see their faces Right But they got Websites That get like 500,000 hits per minute Craziness like that But They in a cafe or something You know what I'm saying They in the club By themselves in the corner Right But they sociable and person, but they just don't like on the, on the internet because of the trolls and things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? So don't limit yourself. Work both worlds, man. That's how you win out here, man. The two percent understand that, man. Real B Sales University. Go join right now, man. Become part of the two percent. Stop playing yourself, man. Because uh, when you get put in a situation to win, you're not gonna know how to handle it, man. And the two percent know, man. They get placements. Shout out to Kevin Miller. He got a huge. Placement That I didn't even know about He kept it on a low man He did a real good job And mind you This dude is my partner man Um And he's doing something huge I was He finally let me know Why he was in California For almost three months Yo All I gotta say is man Work The streets And the internet Cause he did it This guy hated Facebook But he came online 
I started coaching him. It was that September of what's this? Fifteen, two thousand fourteen. He came online, started doing his thing, made a couple of connects. He hopped on Twitter for maybe three days and met this dude, man. And, and somehow the people I know them from when I used to do music back in like in ninety, was it ninety eight, ninety nine? But they in California now. Things happen, man. Like, use this stuff, man. There's great resources out here, man. This is information you need, man. Right? You like this video, like it, leave a comment, you know, things of that nature. Let me know what's going on out there, man. Uh, let me know how you do offline and online. Does it work for you? Do you combine them? Or do you, which one do you prefer? This is Al, and I'm out. Thanks for subscribing, too. Later. Later.